Hey guys, Rick here again. I'll get started here in a minute. As soon as people pop in, I'm here with my cat Morris. Well, I was. My live chat's on. JCU out there. Nick. But anyways, as you know, I just did a live video at Wall Fruit. At Wall Fruit. Walmart earlier to show you what you could do and getting a on a budget ghost hunting quim, or kit started up okay but while I was there I picked up two things okay this uh top grip whoops tripod by Bauer and this 50 LED light from Bauer all right. Now, the reason why I'm putting these two to get together is I figure there's not much to talk about because they're just two simple things. So I'm just gonna do it like I am instead of doing it separate. So first off, the tripod. Okay. Yes, it is plastic. It does have a a metal ball head. Uh. It has a 360 pan, prevents camera shake, okay, and fits most smartphones. I almost said fart phones there for a minute, but I'm glad I corrected myself. And it seems like it's pretty comfy in your hand as well. It's not very big, guys. You'll be surprised once I take it out of the box. But that's what the box looks like in the front. You got the both sides. They'll say the same thing, but with different pictures. The back. I know you can't read that because I, I sure hell can't. And the other side. Again, same different or same uh, crap and different picture. All right. I hope my sound's working. Yeah. So let's get this thing out of the box. First, you got your little instruction booklet and the tripod itself. This is all the bigger it is, guys. Oops, right here. All right, it's you got the, your little three legs with the rubber feet at the bottom. This is like those uh, what the heck do you call those uh, Ulanzi kind of selfie stick type uh, tripod where you just pull out your legs and you just sit it down like that all right uh this does not extend the only thing it'll do is just spin all right um i think it spins maybe that's just to unloose it but that's all it does uh, that's just unloosening. I'm sorry. I'll take that back. That's unloosening it from the quarter trying thread. Um, the part that spins is this part. That's your phone holder. Now, if this fits most phones, it'll probably fit my A20, my G6, or the Apple iPhone that I got floating around. It has a code shoe on top of here. For that video light, that's the reason why I'm putting it together. It's it's spring loaded, so as you can tell, it could fit a good size cell phone. Okay, a pretty wide cell phone. It does spin. You just you know just kick it out like that, and just give it a twist, and it's and it's other formation. You got the horizontal in your vertical or your portrait or landscape mode okay again put back just lift it out and put back in like that all right i think it's a cute little thing uh it's good for you know people to walk around stores with so you don't have a very big stick to monkey with off the store uh 
inside your buckle ear. It's pretty simple. Just shows you pictures on how they work stuff and whatnot. All right. You could pause the video anytime you want, so you could take a good look at the pictures. Not a back, it'll have its features. I know you can't read that. I have problems reading it. It's so stinking small. Uh, and specifications. Now, this, that's done with. Let's move this on. Hold on a minute. Before I go any further, $6.88 for that before taxes. All right, the tripod. Now, this Bauer light, I didn't know how good it was. Shit. So I turned it on myself and tried it out. It's, it's bright for a little sucker. Um... You first, you got your little instructional booklet. You got all your pictures and doodads inside of there. Okay. Again, on the back, your small writing that you cannot see without a magnifying glass. Uh, has a specifications. Okay. I'll try to read it for you. But, but the only thing I could read is approximately... Uh, 120 minutes of charging time. I don't know where Brian is. Okay. Inside the box. Oh, I forgot to show you the box. Fart. But the box, you know, you know what a box looks like. It looks like a has all them nice little pictures on the side. They're different. Oh, hi, Lacey. Has the different pictures and whatnot. Okay. And in the, in the description, I'll put the, uh, okay, the features and whatnot in the description. The speci specifications. So it'll be easier for to read. Um, now inside the box, you get a nice little tray, as you can see. It's a cute little stinging light. It's pretty bright. It takes a micro USB to charge it. It'll be like what you find in your Android phones. Okay. It's a really short ass cord. If you want something longer, you can get something longer if you want, but that's good enough for me. You get a code shoe. Okay. This code shoe. It's just plastic. All right, uh, I got some metal ones. If I want to stick metal ones on there, so if you want metal ones, get metal ones. I sh they should fit inside this cold shoe in your tripod, just perfectly. I don't know. I gotta get one to find out. These two phones are charging. Next, you got another stinking cell phone. You, you, you could do a portrait or landscape. That'd be your landscape and portrait. All right. Got your code shoe on top. Got the torn, quarter 20 threads on the back and the bottom. So I got three of these suckers now. And they will fit certain phones as well. Uh, if they're like the G6 or A20, not so good with the case on, but you could make them work. I'll save this for last. In the bottom of the box here, you get some filters. Okay, this is your white. Kind of a pinkish amber color or I call them gels I don't know what anybody else would call them and you got the blue which I mostly use the white when I'm doing my crap but now here's the 
And on the bottom of your light, there's a core 20 to screw your cold shoe in. But how to turn this on, you just, you know, push in this little button, hold it in, go turn it on. As you can tell, it's pretty bright for a little snot and light. Uh, it has three modes. That's the low, medium, and high. It has 120 degree you know, range uh, for the lumen uh, of lighting there. Okay. The, turn it off. Just hold and shut off. Now, is that the light? Yeah, it is. Can't read a goddamn thing. There's a 3.7 500 milliamp hour battery in it, so it's rechargeable. 6500K, uh, 50 LEDs, color temperature 80. Again, three brightness levels. <laughs> you blind me. Again, illumination range 120. Battery life approximately 40 minutes on continuous uh, runtime. Then third setting. Ambient temperature is 35 to 60. Okay, that's not that bad. Working temperature is about 35 degrees Celsius. That's the highest it will go. Storage is 60 degrees Celsius, which to minus 10 Celsius on both of them. But you could do the math to figure out the Fahrenheit. <laughs> Has, again, micro USB input, or import, excuse me. 5 amp current core 20 screw in a about third or yeah, 30.8 grams. That's all it weighs. And the size is 73 by 42 by 10 and a half. So I don't like this. Let me screw this in. Just screw it on. These are make good for her. Can't. Does it no it doesn't have infrared, just white light. Just don't go too nuts on the uh, cold shoe doing to be plastic. Just screw it on there. Slide it in your cold shoe and just damn it, screw it down till it tightens up. I gotta get one of my metal ones, see if that will work. Cause I'd rather have the metal ones in my opinion. But uh, it'll look something like that with the phone. All right. Um, again, so here's the here's the kicker, guys. In my Walmart, I don't know if it's in all the WalMarts. They had this marked wrong. They had this at twenty dollars. Okay, nineteen ninety nine. But when I went to ring it up, it rung up fourteen dollars and eighty eight cents. So they better fix that. All right. So. Beware of that. Make sure they got the right price. Now, the filters here, you got two lips down here. You got the corresponding grooves at the bottom. You just stick it in your grooves and just kick it in. It'll just fit right on there, nice and snug. You don't have to worry about losing your lid over top of it. And Again, it diffuses the uh, light, so it won't be as bright in your eyeballs, okay? Um, let me go get a uh, metal uh, core 20 hot, or code shoe, and I'll see if it'll whip, or fit on this. Um, I don't see a white one. Don't vote to hell, you might kill the cats. So, 
before I do that, I'll show you how to take off. You just push on this tab, it'll pop, and it'll just pop off. So, I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Oh, hi, Smoke. I got my bag of cold shoes here. And I'm gonna see how these do on the uh, light. These are all metal. Okay. I just killed the gats. Yeah, they do fit. Picking plastic. Get out of there. He ripped his ass in half. Yeah, I wish I would have done that in wall fart to give a good meaning to wall fart, but I didn't. Okay. Your metal your metal ones do fit in this uh tripod slash selfie stick. So if you want to get some metal Quarter 20 cold shoes, go right ahead. All right. That's all I want to test or test out on this. So, as far as I could tell, I would highly recommend these two things. Uh, like this. Okay. I know it's not a very big freaking handle, but it's a good fat one to hang on to. But... It would be good just for farting around like in the... If Brian was here, you could have a ass ripping contest. <laughs> yeah. You could use this like going, walking around like wall fruit. Ah, wall fruit. Here I go again. Wall fart. Wall fart. Walmart with or anything else. <clears throat> I'm trying not to screw up here. And film away. I know I didn't have any problems filming my Walmart. They seem like they didn't give two freaking shits. Uh, where's the cats? Don't know. That's a good question. So, again, I would recommend both of these. 120 minutes to charge this thing. 40 minutes run time. So... So all in all, I give them a big thumbs up, two thumbs up for it. And Walmart, please fix your sign from 1999 or 88 or whatever the fuck it was to $14.88 because that's misleading people. Um, so again, guys. I'll be back on sometime for another review. I am ordering on our camcorder that does have night vision on it. Um, hopefully, like how it doesn't get freaking lost in the mail. Uh, so I'll stay tuned for that. I'm trying to get my ass out to that abandoned church if it ever stopped raining. So, so if you like this video, again, my name is Rick. Please give a big thumbs up for me, please. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. <clears throat> Ring that notification bell. Select all for me, please. Leave a comment down below. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, please know hate comics. Yeah, hate comics. Let's try that again. Hate comics. <laughs> Sex, soul, content, or any other thing like that on my channel. In the comment section. No cyberbullying, hate shit. I don't put up to that stuff. Till then, I'll catch you on the flip side and keep filming out there. I'm out.